Well, I have an H5 and I love it, but I need something a little flippier and I heard this can get the job done. What up, Dia, mi gente? What's up, my people? It's George Garcia, Vinny and Disc Golfer, coming at you again from the beautiful River City Nature Park with a fantastic review of the Prodigy H4 V2. Um, looking forward to this disc. Uh, I don't have something like this in my bag right now. Right now, um, I do have all the H V2's versions, but don't currently bag this one. I was looking for something a little more understable. I have an H5 and I love it, but I need something a little flippier and I heard this can get the job done. So without further ado, let's get to the test flight. I'm gonna put this on a little bit of a hyzer and let's see what it does. So I held the line pretty well. Um, I gotta say it again, much distance. Man, maybe about 320, 330 or so. I mean, not bad, but uh, I did release it a little high, could release it a little lower, but it held the highest line pretty well. Let's see what the next flight does. All right, so we're gonna put it on a flat release, see what it does. so it did not get the turn that I expected it to get. Then again, I didn't put enough power on it, but that did look straight line enough. All right, so we're gonna put it on a flat release. We're gonna put it on a flat release again. Let's see what it does. Well, the wind pushed it down a little bit. We did get that turn on the high speed but it's, uh, we got a strong tailwind, so it's just pushing it down. But it did get that high speed turn it's supposed to have, so can't complain about that. Uh, let's go harder next time. Let's try uh, the anti line next. All right, so we're gonna put a little bit of anhyzer on it and let's see what it does. Line. Held the line perfectly. Nice finish at the end. Got that beautiful S curve. I like it. Great utility disc. Beautiful flight. Got that beautiful uh, nice turn on it. And it flexes back out. That beautiful S curve. Definitely going to be a great utility disc in my bag. Uh, I'm looking forward to bagging it. Overall, what can I say? I just, I'm in love with the 400 plastic. It just has a very gummy feel. And then you could rip it and you know it's not gonna slip out of your hand and uh that just pretty much held every line i put it on so you know what can you say about things like that you know the prodigy's making great product i mean i know there's a lot of other manufacturers out there but prodigy's uh growing on me i've always thrown prodigy since the beginning and i'd say probably about 70 percent of my bag is now prodigy um so just a great disc overall uh it's gonna fit to a lot of people's bags uh especially for nice tight tonal shots you know you can just let it flip up and kind of just go slightly to the right come back uh, so it's gonna be a great woods disc for me and also you know some, some open shots too so uh, I'm looking forward to bagging it and until my next review guys keep hitting your lines